When you think of a solution that is acetic, you probably don't think of orange juice. However, orange juice contains citric acid, and therefore is an acid, although very weak. Acids are ionic compounds. When they are dissolved in water, they break apart to form hydrogen ions. As well, acids usually have a sour taste and are corrosive. Solutions that are not acids or neutral are called bases. Bases are also ionic compounds. When bases break apart in water, they form negatively charged hydroxide ions. Bases are typically slippery, bitter tasting, and corrosive. When acids and bases react, they form water and a salt. The strength of both acids and bases is dependent on their concentration of hydrogen and hydroxide ions. The greater the concentration of hydrogen ions, the stronger the acid. The greater the concentration of hydroxide ions, the stronger the base. Acids and bases are determined and measured by their pH. pH, written in the form lowercase p, uppercase h, is a measure of the hydrogen activity in a sample substance. By definition, the P stands for potential and the H represents hydrogen. A pH scale is used to indicate how acidic or how basic a substance is. The pH scale ranges from 0 to 14. The scale was developed in the early 1900s by Dr. Sorensen and is believed to have been used initially with the brewing industry. The lower the pH value is, the more acidic the substance is. The higher the value, the more basic. A pH value of 7 indicates a neutral substance. The value of pH can be found using a mathematical formula. pH equals the antilog of the hydrogen ion concentration of a solution. Because the scale is logarithmic, a change in one degree of pH, such as 5 to 4, indicates a difference of 10 times the acidity of a substance. During chemical reactions involving a change of pH, an indicator will be added to the solution. This indicator will cause a color change, which matches the change in pH at specific levels. Some indicators that are used in chemical reactions include naphthalene, phenylphthalein, and thymolphthalein. A naturally occurring indicator from the anthocyanin family of compounds can be found in red cabbage. To make an indicator from red cabbage, the cabbage is first chopped up. placed into a glass container, covered with boiling water, and left to sit for approximately 10 minutes to create a purplish colored solution. After the color drains from the cabbage, the leaves are then removed from the solution. Although the solution has a color, it is considered to be neutral, assuming the water used was neutral, as the pH of pure water is 7. In reality, however, water used on a daily basis for cooking, cleaning, and drinking can have a pH rating of anywhere between 6.5 and 8.5. Now, common acids and bases can be added to the solution from red cabbage to determine if they are acidic or basic. Acids will cause the indicator to change to a color that is more dark and red, while bases will cause it to turn a more blue or green color. This solution is an acid. It is actually vinegar, which contains acetic acid, CH3COOH. This substance is a base. It is sodium bicarbonate, NaHCO3, which is more commonly known as baking soda. It is necessary to know and maintain the pH value of many solutions and substances. For example, blood has a pH value that normally falls between 7.35 and 7.45. The kidneys and lungs work naturally together to regulate the pH level of blood. 
The pH of water used in aquariums for pet fish depends on the fish that are living there. Some saltwater creatures thrive in water that has a higher pH, around 8 or above. Freshwater fish do better in the range of 5.5 to 7.5. The pH value of pool water is monitored and adjusted to ensure a safe facility. This water needs to be kept within a range of 7 and 7.6. I'm Calvin and I lifeguard at the downtown YMCA. So we test the pools hourly and we test them for chlorine levels and pH levels. And we test them to make sure they're at a safe level. Understanding acids and bases creates an appreciation of the pH value of the liquid inside this juice box. Remember, when it comes to acids, it is customary to consume citric, but it is significantly serious to swallow sulfuric. <laughs>